Warning, this video contains graphic images that may not be suitable for little sissy bitches, so if your discretion is advised, we kill shit here. I'm out here with Illegal Outdoors. <laughs> out here on the line. First stop, we got a coon. He's mad. Big old coon. Pretty good sized coon. Not happy he tore up my bobcat set. You guys see me catch a double here. And up the way, I caught one last year. So we'll get him taken care of and we'll go ahead and remake this because you never know when the bobcat's going to come through. Stay tuned. Really? <laughs> All right, guys, we, uh, Remington killed my drill making bait with me, so I had to buy a new one. And then I killed my hammer, so I'm using Remington's hammer. So it all works out in the end. You can take all this shit. This is for Bobcat, so we, they don't care what, how, the more tore up, the better. I'm kind of talking to them and you at the same time, if you want to. If you want to stand where you can see. Clearly, I can put my trap there. So I need to bring this down a little bit. I mean, you see how that sticks out? Mm -hmm. First year using an auger and I love it. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> That's so much easier. That's a hundred times better. So much easier. And that drill is only like forty dollars at Walmart. I'm gonna have to get me something like that. All right, so you can see we're wet. Oh yeah. That will freeze. And I don't worry too much about the clods, but I don't want these giant ones in there. Yeah. I didn't sift it when I got it. I'll just them in the powder basically that's just to keep my trap from sticking to the ground don't worry about the raccoon that was on it or any of that stuff Trying to make it look like something was, yep. You know, the raccoon helped us out with that. But. It don't take very much. You don't want too much, or it'll be. Frozen. Yeah. And my nephew went and shot a bunch of pheasants. Gave me this stuff, so. Look at how colorful it is. <laughs> I'm just making it look really good. Cat's gonna be like, what's going on? Then I'll get some bait.
Very attractive to cats. And coons, obviously. <laughs> but it's that's what happens when you got nice weather here. When it warms up, we get coons coming from everywhere. So, But that's pretty, you can see the eye appeal. Yeah, definitely. It's all tore up. Definitely. Now, you said you're trapping your sideways. I put it in like this. Because right. if you put your trap this way, they could it could kick their feet out. Really? So you do that. You want everywhere? it so? Yeah, I try to. So, you, so that's what I need. To do. My. That's, I'm not doing that. So. You, I can't. I'll show you on the next one, but your tabs are going this way. Right, right, right. Yeah, yeah that's what I'm saying. Sometimes it doesn't work out that right. way. Right. It all depends on the trap too. Oh, I'm just doing too. It all depends on the trap where the. Uh, you i wouldn't want to put that like that because i'm i'm picturing their offset so i would put it like this one so they step here instead of stepping on this gotcha, gotcha. you know when they walk up to it i'm yeah. getting I'm, I'm hoping that this foot comes right so i kind of try to put the trap like that yeah. they don't always sometimes i just toss it in there yeah. but i don't put them like this anymore because most of the time they stand right there yeah i've been missing a bunch <laughs> so I, I wish they could still stand right here right but but more than likely you put this to the you put this to your hole you're already your you know what they say six and yeah nine. six to nine and i'm you're trying to get fox too right. so the close you gotta kind of be close Coon day, it looks like. <laughs> looks like it. At least catching something. Yep. Sometimes it's good to have something in the traps, whether it's something you want or not. Yeah. Some days I'm like, thank you, possum. <laughs> well, it made my set look better. Yeah, dude. Because uh, I haven't caught anything in this one yet, but now that everything will see that and be attracted to it. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, I guess I'm remaking again. <laughs> Coon day. I really thought it was a coyote when I pulled up. Fuck, sweet. <laughs> and then finally got a coyote in there. <laughs> Woo! -hoo! She froze in there. Well, we could let you go, buddy. You want to go free? I should have put the catch ball on. We'll let him go. I'll get something real quick. I had my catch ball on my four wheeler and I. Yeah, I usually don't let much go, but I'll let this guy go. He's not very big. <laughs> How do you like my trail, by the way? Yeah, it's good, man. It's, it's kind of cool to cruise on. Too bad. No, he would be a pretty fur. They're real pretty. All right, man, let's go. You gonna be friendly? Well, all he has to do is just stay there. Yeah, you might have to hold him. Get him back on his belly. There you go. Hold him there. All right, get out of here. <laughs> Let it go. He's perfectly fine. Well, hopefully, my lock was recording. <sighs> you? <Yeah. laughs> huh? What'd you say? I said, hopefully, I was recording. Yeah, it's flashing. <laughs> <laughs> he gone. He's ready to say tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> uh, if he's back in there tomorrow, that'll be the end of that. <laughs> we won't deal with that no more.
You just do it straight down, don't you? Well, it's kind of, yeah, kind of. If you go too much, they can see down in there. You want them to have to come up and look down in. Get all the shit out of here. Don't do this. You really yeah. were recording? Yeah. I didn't think I got it either. <laughs> oh my god. You were I thought you were recording everything. Uh, I recorded the coon, man. <laughs> <laughs> I turned it off. So oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I just stuck my hand in there because I thought you was recording. Damn it. Jesus. My bad, man. <laughs> <laughs> he says I wish I was recording. Dang. I'm like, what? <laughs> you drove me eight hours. Oh shit. I didn't think he's gonna do that. <laughs> I was like, dang. Uh, My bad. I don't think I even got it. I was looking at you. <laughs> <laughs> oh crap. Good times, man. Yeah, well, I'm glad I caught something. Yeah, me too. It's a lot of pressure. It is. I'm sure you've invited people over and you're like, oh, yeah. oh my god, we ain't gonna, I don't know if we're going to catch anything. Yeah. Last year it was possums, is all I caught, and the skunk. When I invited Flair the first time, or while well, he invited himself, yeah. I'm like, man, I ain't going to catch shit. Yeah. Two coyotes and a fox. <laughs> yeah, I, I got real, man. I got lucky. <laughs> I'm like, catch him every day and send him pictures and then... And then don't get shit on the day he comes. Yeah. That's how it goes. Like, I caught that coyote yesterday, like, man, why couldn't you wait one day? Yeah, it, like, uh, like, uh, my buddy CJ went online with me the other day. Didn't catch shit. And the next day, I catch a freaking coyote. He's like, he's like, damn it. Yeah. <laughs> like, well, you went the wrong day. <clears throat> but some shit happens. <laughs> and I invited you again today. And he said, no, I'm good. We probably won't catch you anyway. <laughs> Yeah, you're probably right, but... You never know, man. <laughs> They're all different. All days are different. <clears throat> I ain't caught a coon in a long time. Have you not? And then suddenly, we got two of them. I just didn't know if you wasn't filming them or not. <laughs> no, well, a lot of times I don't. But I haven't even really tried for them, so... Was this, this was the first, this was the... Yeah, the deer keep knocking it down. It's, so I stuck it in a tree way down there. Yeah, I seen it. I was like, this is the first... Time, first one he put this in, I think. Yeah, I moved it from down where I showed you where me and Flair set. Yeah. And the deer won't leave it alone, so I had to pull it. What's that? Hell, a uh, soul taker. Oh, is it? Yep. Boy, mine looks a whole lot different than that. It's all different, I think. This one's a coyote plus bobcat, so I don't want to litter the whole area with feathers. Right. But we'll put a few here. Well, coyotes not like it. Yeah, sometimes that stuff scares them. Really? It's like they're smart to it. Hmm. Uh oh. Looky there. Is that that is that that is that, that one that goes out and sees if it's safe? Mm -hmm. They're here, man. We're real close to where I want to hunt. Yeah, I'm telling you, man. If you've never seen it, I've never seen it. And be like, oh my god. I had thousands of them. I'm the so excited. I'll be so excited, man. It was, it was freaking awesome. I got it on film. Hell yeah. Heck yeah, dude. She's pretty, man. All right, guys. I've only caught male. Yeah. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's a female. They're usually pretty timid. Female? I'm pretty <laughs> sure it's a female, but all right, guys. I had a dirt hole set here. I, this is where I caught that fox. Oh, probably a week or so ago. Nothing snowed on it. Everything snows melted. You just, that's why you just keep on driving by. Keep driving by. If you, if you're already here, you might as well just leave your sets. We got the coyote. I mean, two raccoons, coyote, a couple of close calls, and then. You know, I'm already coming through here. There's no point in moving this trap. I know that they, they run these edges. You can see it in the snow. 
I'm a, I like to sit in this woods right here, but I don't like getting off my foiler every single day. You're, you're talking three months of trapping. You don't want to get off and go in there all the time. There's bobcats in there, but they're also come out here too. You're yeah. after after a week, you're like, why am I doing this? <laughs> That's what I thought too. <laughs> why am I doing this? But you seen my trails I'm cutting? We're gonna oh, yeah. we're planning on putting one through there. Thank so you. it'll be a lot better. Alright, we'll get her taken care of and show you guys up close. Appreciate you guys being here. Make sure you hit up my buddy, Illegal Outdoors. Oh, Drove wow. all the way from Oklahoma to see this coyote right here. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna go get some dirt. I just forgot I used all my dirt, so we'll come back and remake this. It was a female. Real nice coat. Beautiful dog. It's a beautiful dog for sure. It ain't very big, but it's still a nice guy. Yeah. <sighs> yep. We'll move on and. So maybe we got some more. My best spot's still coming up. That's where I caught one yesterday. And I lost one yesterday because he chewed through a cable. And that's the problem with cable restraints. There's a chance that they might chew through. So I think we got one. Yeah. We do got one. Got we got one. Yeah. We'll take it. I got several traps over here where it gets a little better. See one. I mean, I've seen them. You got one or two in the home. I've never even seen one up close, man. You don't have very many. They say they used to have a bunch of them. Look at that tail on that thing. That is nuts. Good. That's pretty neat. Uh oh. What? He ain't got no foot. Wow. That's my first time ever catching a three legged critter. That's cool. Wow, that's crazy. Too bad they already got a mount done. Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Huh. Look at the dang claws, man. Yeah, they got some claws. What in the hang? That's why I say they're like, come at me, bro. That's pretty neat. Three legged muskrat. Three legged muskrat. Let me darn. Heck yeah. I did not empty my magazine on that one. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Now I'm going to wait out here. Yep, we got one here. It's a good size one. Cool. Yeah. That's pretty sweet. What did you say the other day you'd rather catch a, a rat than a what? Bobcat. I, I, I like catching rats because you catch them every day. Yeah. I'd like to catch a mink. Once the size comes off, there's a good chance of getting one, but I can't walk this every day. Yeah. Take too much time. This is what happens when you wait too long to hold the traps. <laughs> when you get a warm spell. You literally walked out of your waiter. This one's stuck too. Huh? I do? You might have to grab your like knee and pull up. There you go. Mm-hmm. 
Sucks. It sucks right here. I'm not even sinking like that. Huh? I'm not really sinking. Oh. Terrible. Yeah. You might have to just meet me back over by where we parked. It's going half to half. Just push that to me and I'll get some shit done and we'll go hunting. Huh? I said I'll get some shit done and we'll go hunting. Alrighty, I'll see you back there. Cause I gotta break through down there to get all the way across. <laughs> really, for real? I can't it. Oh. If you're still down here stuck in the ice, I'll come back for you. Come uh, on, I'm out of here. Oh. I didn't make it very far. You gonna get out? Oh, the legal's man down. Man down. man down, he's stuck. Yeah. I'm a hot step in it. It's a workout right here. <laughs> Call the medics. Illegal stuck. Call the medics. Fire and rescue. I'm talking about fucking workout right here. <laughs> He's still crawling. He ain't gonna make it. Illegal died in Missouri. Take your time, man. Are you at least recording? Huh? You ain't even recording. <laughs> man down. Man down. It's probably the hardest bottom we got. Where I went and retrieved Flair's ducks, I almost died. It was like waist deep mud. One day too late, guys. Waited just a little too long and now it's all hard to walk on. Maybe it'll make that beer taste better. Oh no! <laughs> Yeah, I usually laugh at myself, funny. Yeah. Hey, I caught a snapping turtle. Look what you, look what you missed out on. He's still alive. He's not very happy.
This is a workout. Well, we are watching Illegal turn this fin for his life. We got a freaking snapping turtle here. He has somehow bent my trap to where it's not in line anymore. Here we go. Ain't nothing wrong with him. He's perfectly fine. Catch him all the time. I'd rather they stay out of my traps. To be honest. He made it, you're on land. Two rat sets here and I got a colony there. There is a ton of bubbles here. Take it. One more for the road. We're definitely pulling because it's not very good here. We'll have to move north. All right. I'm in the ditch. The pelican's right around the corner there. And there's a something going on here. Feed bed of some sort. I get better ice in my traps. It's a whole lot better. But somehow this one here don't catch anything. I don't know how I'm missing him. There's like nothing there. But this one here gets every every time going in and out. I don't know how I'm missing him out there. But I am. Well, that's gonna be it for this muskrat line for a while. I'll take whatever distance I can get on the ice. <laughs> it's like in a cartoon, you just see all the cracks, you're like, oh no, oh no. How deep is it? How deep is it? Oh. <laughs> oh my. <sighs> yeah, the joys of trapping. It's so easy, they say. Yeah. Nothing, man. All you do is set traps, kill animals. Anybody could do it. I just want to get back up on the ice. <laughs> nope. I'm not getting back on. I need a toboggan.
You guys want to work out? Come try this. Treadmill what? <laughs> you gotta push down and lift and you gotta use your muscles to push down to break it. Then you gotta drag it out of the mud. <sighs> oh yeah, you know, you seen it, you done it. I'm almost there. I got lots of uh I got lots of uh video of you, I think. Just put it on there. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. Oh you definitely didn't go very far across that ice. <sighs> I sure wish I could go like that. Oh, <clears throat> Don't get stuck. <sighs> the joys. It's hard on the guy's waders also.